You know, I, I, I'm literally stunned listening to you. Uh, earlier in the conversation, you mentioned dropsy. And, and I, I was blown away that police officers would be so cavalier. Uh, and even disclosing to, uh, you're the medical examiner, but to, to even say, uh, no, he didn't drop it. We dropped it for him. It, it, that That's insane. I mean, obviously, uh, myself being an African-American man, we know that this goes on in the community um, all too well. Um, but, but just to think that police would, would be so open about it. And then secondarily, uh, the thought was <clears throat> the medical examiner, the prosecutor, and the police, they, it's a team. And I, I don't know. I just think what you said was just so powerful. And um, it brings to light so much of what we already know has been going on behind the scenes for so many years. Yeah, I think I think. A great deal of the problem is that as I started out, I was a Jewish kid in the Fort Greene projects all by myself, and there were gangs and all, and uh, I learned very much that I was an outsider with, with, where I grew up because there were very few Jewish cha Jewish uh, families there. Uh I had a friend, my best friend was a black fellow, Justice Taylor, who uh, uh, went to school together. And we were both outsiders. We were both outsiders that, uh, uh, in, the, in the community that we lived in. Um, when I came into the medical examiner's office it began, and were a, dealt with a lot of police, it was, and this is New York City, it was clear that the reason there were so many more black people in jails and prisons uh, than the population would suggest uh, was that there was and there is a concern that there's a higher rate, we were told, a higher rate of bad people. The, 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 the bad people are in prison and we're the good people. The, the police and the prosecutors uh, and the medical examiner working to get the, the bad people in prison and that part of the reason that all they're more bled uh, uh, people in prison is because of the way the the legal system works and the way that uh, uh, that in the projects there are uh, not enough ways to get out into the real world and they get arrested more not for not because they're doing bad things necessarily, but with the dropsy situation, because the, the police think they're bad to begin with. So if they see a kid on a bicycle or something that uh, doing bad things, and he doesn't stop, especially if they don't stop immediately, if they say stop, uh, there'll be ways in which to, to uh, arrest them and they get into, uh, and we as medical examiners see more dead uh, uh people of black and brown color for many reasons uh, other than um, uh, other than natural conditions. Natural conditions work, uh, there's no problem, but in, in the medical examiner world where we see accidents, suicides, homicides, um, a lot more uh, uh, people of color than uh, the population would indicate, and it's not necessarily because, and it definitely isn't because they're born bad as as uh, uh, the attitude is that uh, black people are born badder than white people. That's why they get more into trouble with the police. And uh, that's just uh, uh, initially it's easy to believe that because we see uh, the police arresting more black people. But uh, uh, it's, there are other reasons uh, other than behavior that gets them, uh, that we as medical examiners do more autopsies on black people.